Hi everyone, so I'm back to share another journal with you and this one is um, an autumn themed journal and it's using a kit from Artie Mays and it's called Fruits of Autumn and that is what I've titled uh, the the journal on the book plate which is a Tim Holtz book plate. I've used this lovely fabric which I believe I got from Artie Mays and it feels really nice, it's a nice thick fabric. I've done a, a double, um, double stitch all the way around uh, the cover. Um, Artie Mays is linked below so please go over and have a look at her new kits. Um, this will be listed in my shop if you're interested. So I put, um, I used my full memo to um, write out the fruits of autumn to fit inside of there as well and we have uh, oh the measurements for this eight and a quarter five across one signature 68 pages front and back and it will be available in my shop. So let's go inside. <clears throat> so, oh, I forgot I was supposed to put a book plate on there. Not a book plate, a stamped, um, to, just to hide these brads which hold that on. So I will do that as soon as I get off, uh, finish filming this. Um, I'm just going to cover that over with this book belongs to um, on a separate piece of card. I know there was something I had to do. <laughs> so like I said, the kits from Artie Mays, love this kit, love the fruits. It's very harvesty and all that kind of stuff, love it. So you get these big, large, um, uh, not sayings, what are they, like definitions, I don't know. Um, I'm lost for what I really am. <laughs> Can't remember, quotes, that's the word, just simple one, quotes. That's some stamping. Got a tag here, got a postcard, a bit of noise going on outside tonight, um, another a double layered tag and we have a book page and another book page. This is um, this is really funny, I wish I could read, my dad used to be able to, he, he wrote music and he, he was very good at reading, wrote it and, and read it well because he was um, musically talented. Um, these are Scottish dances. Now, I don't know what that actually says, <laughs> but when I was at school, we did get taught Scottish dancing um, because when we had our Christmas parties and things like that, when we were in primary school, we used to have to do all the um, the dances and stuff. So we've got an envelope there. Whoopsie. And that's paper clipped on here. There's nothing in the envelope. Um, these, I was going to put these in it, but then I just put them there. And some more stamping there, coffee dyed paper, some lined paper, another lovely page from the kit. Here I just used um, a scrap of uh, one of the pages and I turned it into a double pocket. And another quote there, another double layered tag and another tag from the kit. There's lots of this is a real kind of writing journal. Another quote, another pocket. Here we have another tag from the kit, another journal card. Uh, there's actually two kits, I think. You've got the um, Fruits of Autumn, and then there's another one that's called um, Build It. That's it. I think it's Fruits of, Fruits of Autumn Build It. Um, so you get tags and you can build up. Um, the layers and stuff which is a really good idea another vintage book page some grid paper some lined paper this is it's old i don't know if it's vintage um but it's it's old it's not like a new book <laughs> some lined paper center of signature some nice markings on that page some more lined paper and grid paper, vintage book page, another quote from the kit. Here we have a tag, a postcard from the kit and another double layered tag. Uh, I did have to chop a piece off because I turned, obviously these come in full journal sizes, you know, like uh, A4 size, but obviously I chopped it down to make it a Traveller's Notebook size-ish, <laughs> slightly bigger than a Traveller's Notebook. Three of the tickets and I've just made a pocket and just put them on there. A bit of stamping here, another postcard, another double journal card and I've backed that with some lined paper so you can write on there. 
crochet trim another envelope there there's nothing in the envelope and then we've, it's just folded over paper clipped on and i'm doing a video i'm actually doing a video don't see anyone for hours as soon as you put the camera on they all come say hello <laughs> he's just come in from a night out um so yeah book pages um music paper and another quilt from the um kit a tag a postcard and another double layered tag so this was a i haven't really done much this week and some of you some of you know why uh, it's been a bit of a hectic week um and yes i've got to put that on there so i've been really slow in doing stuff just been spending time with family and just you know when you just can't be bothered <laughs> that's how i felt all week <sighs> just can't be bothered so i'm getting my backside back into gear again because i must admit i didn't do a lot but i've enjoyed the last like a little bit yesterday and, and today crafting really kind of boosted my spirits um so yeah any questions about the journal um please feel free to ask away um and this will be listed at my shop and have a great weekend and i'll be back soon with some more things to share with you bye